Just for tummy rubs? Hi. Hi, buddy. How you doing, buddy? All right, so last week was a lot. It was a lot of fun, but it was a lot. A lot of socializing, a lot of meeting different people. Yeah, it was a great time, no regrets. But for a heavily introverted person like myself, it just was a lot, and I think after all of it was done, meeting people, if you saw the short, we went on a little pub crawl, all the socializing and the alcohol, I think just completely depleted my body, both physically and mentally. So this week we're slowing it down. Start off with some skincare, some mist. Mm. I'm gonna go in with the sunscreen I've been really enjoying lately. This is the Centella or Madagascar Centella from Skin1004 all over the face. Yeah, this week we're just gonna have a slower weekend. Just do things that make me comfortable, happy, and you know, that like really recharge me. I'm going with this eye serum from Youth to the People. Um, it uses synthetic mica, so not only does the caffeine help depuff over time, but the mica also help reflect the light for like a more immediate effect, which I like. I'm gonna keep the makeup very light today. I'm gonna go in with this Tower 28 blush and just, oh, might be a bit much, but just gonna blend that out. I love doing my skincare and makeup. It's one of those self-care activities that not only make me feel good, but also look good and just feel more confident. Um, it's a win-win situation. I should also definitely be doing this with a mirror, not the screen of my camera, but here we are. And then honestly, I think I'm just gonna finish off with this like translucent balm from Tower 28 as well. It's the Super Dew No Shade. It's literally just like a clear balm. You just get that nice glowy look, no glitter, no sparkles, almost just sweaty. It's kind of like Vaseline, but it's not as like sticky as Vaseline. It's just a nicer formulation. Yeah, here's the completed look, nice and glowy, natural, literally took less than three minutes and just, you know, helped me feel a bit more confident. I also treated myself to something that I've been contemplating for at least Feels like a year and a half now. Here they are, these are the AirPod Maxes in the space gray. I've been contemplating these for so long now. I know that objectively they are overpriced for what they are. But when I recently lost my regular AirPods that I've been using, I waited a few weeks to see if I actually wanted to make the upgrade and um, here we are. <laughs> I absolutely love them. They make me really happy. And uh, you know, decided to treat myself. And you know, I don't think I need to justify every large purchase, but when a lot of my content revolves around being less shitty and trying to reduce overconsumption, I think it's just fair to kind of talk through my personal thought process. But at the end of the day, you do you, boo. Yeah, I'm just gonna head outside, go listen to some music, uh, pick up some little groceries, and uh, just kind of spend like a quieter afternoon. All right, quick fit check before we head out. These are the less shitty jelly flared wide leg corduroy trousers. Still trying to figure out a better name. But yeah, these are the final pre-production samples. Length needs to be a little bit longer for me. But I mean, just look at this funky flare. That is a funky flare. The Leshy tote bag. This jacket is from Aritzia. Of course, the star of the show. Look at that. So cute. Okay, let's go. So anytime I want something nutritious and hearty and just also very easy to make, this is what I go with. This is a Korean soybean paste soup. I did a super simple version with just tofu, zucchini, and some potatoes. Mm. It's just delicious with some rice. Mm-hmm. Gonna have that with a little sparkling water. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Like this is so simple, but it's just so good. Also, the walk by the water was exactly what I needed. Just chill, listen to music. I just really appreciated being able to, you know, spend my alone time, you know, looking at this like beautiful nature. Just being very thankful and grateful uh, just for everything. Mm. You know, I'm not the biggest fan of zucchini, but I think it just works really well in this dish. I picked up these almond crush pockies, biscuit sticks from the store. Wow, wow, wow. Interesting. 
that is delicious. Super chocolatey. Mm hmm. Look at this sleepy guy. Big stretches for the dog, huh? What you doing, Jasper? Look at this guy. Now, today's gonna be a chill work from home day. I could go into the studio, and I love going to the studio. I think today I just wanna have a quiet day. I don't. This is my vintage Japanese dining chair I recently picked up from Facebook Marketplace. Just look how stunning. We got the chrome that works with the chrome. We got the orange that contrasts the blue. And the orange in the kitchen. Just absolutely beautiful. Good morning, Jasper. This morning I actually have a massage booked. I am very excited for it. My traps, anyone that sits for a long time, kind of works on your computer, your traps are probably fucked. deep tissue work right before exercise, especially because we went in on kind of like the lateral aspect of my calves. That's where I have a lot of tightness, also on my traps, but because berries involves a lot of running and I have very flat feet, um, definitely felt it in my calves today, but regardless, I feel amazing now. Today we're just gonna continue on from yesterday's chill and slow theme. It's a very rainy, rainy day today. I'm gonna shower tidy up the house, maybe cook something. Whenever I film these kind of days, I personally really enjoy it myself, but I just kind of feel a little bit guilty because I feel like as a content creator, it's not really exciting or as dynamic. There's not a lot of like scene changes or transitions. You know, my channel has never been like the most exciting or adventurous content, so I feel like it's fine, but I don't know, just I get in my head, you know? <laughs> risotto type dish but instead of using arborio rice because it takes so long i'm going to be using orzo which is just like a small grain shaped pasta i'm going to keep it very simple we got some butter a little bit of parm lemon and pepper cacacho e pepe orzo risotto why not add some white wine add the orzo once it's nice and toasty, we're gonna start adding in our liquid. I'm just gonna use some veggie broth. Not gonna be too meticulous with it, because all you gotta do is just let the pasta boil. But you also don't want too much liquid, or it becomes like a soup. Forget the garlic, some parm. Look how big this lemon is. It's not even gonna... Sheesh. Okay, we're gonna have to put it in the wrong way. This is not the right way, folks. But... What the... Oh my god. Lots of pepper. Here we are folks, you know, not the most balanced meal, but not every meal has to be perfectly balanced. That's why you eat multiple meals throughout the day. It tastes exactly how you would expect it to taste it. Lemony, peppery, 
a little bit cheesy. I wish I had some like mushrooms on hand so I could kind of make this like a mushroom risotto, especially on this like super rainy day. It's dark in here. It's just the vibe. Mm. Mm. Can't be the only one snacking on something. So we'll get some frozen pumpkin, some frozen plain Greek yogurt, some blueberries, and this keeps him busy for at least about an hour, which is really great. And yeah, it just gives him some enrichment, especially on like rainy, gloomy days like this. He really enjoys it. Took a nap. How was it? Amazing. <sighs> Jasper's relaxing by the fire. Jasper's by the fire? Jasper's Jasper. by the fire. Jasper. Oh, hey, Daddy's here to say hi. Oh, fire, fire dog. Fire dog. You shit all over yourself. Did you eat a top of today? Yes. Oh my god. How was your day? It was good. Yes. Super slow at work. It's a rainy, 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 Easter rainy, rainy day. Easter day. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Yep. Five for one ninety nine. Yes. How cute these are. Wow, wow, wow. Mm, snacks. So this is like half price for a quarter of the volume, though. I can't get this one. This is like a soup stock. It's like a tea bag with all the goodies in here. What's this one? That one's just green onion instead of. Oh, okay. okay. I'll get this one. Thank, Thank you. Mmm. Mmm. So, you don't like some jungle. Maybe we can give him a, a little bit of the skin. Dunk it in here. You're holding your chopsticks. Oh. But you're dunking it with your hands. <laughs> Pork cock is so underrated. Mm. I don't think I ever had pork cock until you introduced me to it. Right? And it's so good. Underrated. It's so good. This is. Mm. Radish kimchi. But it's like. Mmm. Wilty. It's yummy. Mmm. It's like soft and crunchy. Mmm. Mmm. Huh? Mm. Mmm, that's so good. <laughs> People who haven't had that are missing out. That's really good, especially with this one too. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. How was all of last week's socialization for you? I'm pretty dead. Yeah. Especially because you get to like basically work and then come right to like all of the gatherings. I feel like it's just extra exhausting. And there was just so many like instances of new people. A lot of new people. People you haven't met. But also, people you haven't seen in a long time. I love this skin. Give me four of them. No. It's really four dog. skins. That's, uh. And yeah folks, that's pretty much it for this slow, slow vlog. Take some time. Slow down. Say no to things. And just, you know, learn to get comfortable being by yourself. And doing things by yourself. How did you like this slow, slow weekend? You loved it, huh? So much time with daddy. Yes, he loved it, he loved it. That's it. Hope you enjoyed the vlog. Bye. Bye. No Bye. way, we gotta say remember to be less shitty. Bye. 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 Just fist bump. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, <laughs> that was adorable. Thank you. <laughs>